up second gen guys today we're gonna be doing some work on my 1997 dodge 5.9 single cab short bed truck this was my great grandpa's truck it's fairly clean but you know what i have the same issue you have when i'm driving at night i can hardly see so what we're gonna do today is we're gonna convert headlights taillights fog lights all to leds and put in some aftermarket lenses that are much cleaner Let's take a look at these headlights and taillights and figure out exactly why I'm doing this. To start off, this is old plastic, so it's normal for this stuff to fog up. My marker lights aren't too bad, but if we're going to be doing them, why not just make this a single headlight, the one-piece ones? You can see we got some condensation up in there. You're not supposed to have water in your headlights if you didn't know. Fogged up. Not good. Now the taillights, they must work because when I stop, people stop too and don't rear end me. But the plastic's cracked. This is all dingy, and yeah, that one's super dingy there. So why not we just replace those bad boys, make the truck look even better than what it already looks. We're not gonna be doing the third brake light. I think that one's aftermarket, correct me if I'm wrong, but it doesn't look factory, and I didn't get one and I forgot about it. When I was looking at headlights and taillights, I really wanted to see these on trucks, and you can do that, but people don't show you the brightness, compare them versus stock, anything like that. So I'm gonna do that for you guys. I'm gonna show you what these stock headlights look at at night, the taillights, and then I'm gonna show you what the aftermarket with the LEDs look at night, daytime, everything like that. We'll also show you how to hook them up because you don't just hook them up because I'm also going to have driving lights that we're gonna to have to wire in, and you also gotta do some stuff to the taillights. So let's get in this video, show you guys what this looks like at nighttime, get the new ones hooked up and compare them. Right to start, I wanted to do something that was kind of factory looking, but not necessarily factory and gonna be brighter than stock. And so these are the headlights we went with here. These came as a kit with the taillights. I will put a link down in the description below. These were $205 for the headlights and taillights. The taillights are LED, headlights were not. So I bought bulbs separately that would replace them. We'll use the factory halogen bulbs for the blinkers, which can convert those LED someday, but did not. So 205 for all that. And these headlights also do have driving lights that so we'll probably hook up right there and show you all how to do that. For the bulbs, I just got these. I looked up 1997 Dodge Ram 1500 headlights and fog light bulbs LEDs. And so it came with this kit for like $25. Came with the right plug and everything. So plug in to the factory plug there. And then it also came with these LEDs that will pop in the fog lights. These are plastic. These are like 20 bucks. So you can't really argue for the money and got the LED bulb in there. Anyways, we're gonna pop out these stock headlights and get these ones in there and show you what we have to do if there's any adjustments and tweaks gotta be done. fog lights they came with regular halogens all you do twist that bulb it'll slide out place your led in there Don't mind the bugs going crazy, but for the taillights, drop your tailgate. You got two star heads here. It appears that it's a T25. So we got this guy right here. I believe this is a resistor. Anyways, it's got this double sided tape here. And what we'll do is clean the surface up right in here stick that to there plug the led right into where this bulb's plugged in now and just pop in the reverse light with the halogen bulb if you're 
gonna go with these headlights, it is a little difficult to get the LEDs in here. So we're gonna show you how I go about that. Didn't. You just plug them in. 15 minute job. I know. Pop that out. Voila. How's your Don't now? touch that. Don't touch those unless you wanna ruin them. And go ahead and pop your LED in there. First, gotta put that bad boy over. Oh, never mind. Never mind. I ain't gonna trash it. For that out the hard way. Once you got your LED in, this came factory or with the new aftermarket headlights. So we're gonna cut this plastic off so we don't get a bunch of stuff up in there. And slide that bad boy on and then we'll throw the headlight on and then show you and hopefully they're brighter no promises you then have this rubber piece here that has little clips that'll pop in So a couple important things to mention. So the low beams with the fog lights are actually brighter than the high beams, which is okay. I like running up the low, or the fog lights on at all times. I'm just weird, more lights. I think it's cooler. And also, I think I'm going to have to get some type of like blinker relay for LEDs because the blinkers blink super slow. Do one last walk around of the truck. I really like how they look. The truck's looking super clean, I think. The taillights, I tell a big difference. Those are super bright when I hit them. You can just see it shining in the rear view mirror. She's looking clean though. Headlights are brighter than ever. I ended up the driving lights, those are just tied into my fog lights. So when I turn the fog lights on, those will come on. It's just those three lights there. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to give it a thumbs up, like, subscribe, all that good stuff, and share it to your fellow second gen friends. Anyways, if you want to see other stuff done to the second gen Dodge, leave it down in the comments below. I'm willing to do more stuff to this truck, maybe headers, I don't know, wheels, tires, can't tell you. But I do like how it turned out. They don't fit the best, but that's aftermarket stuff and the LEDs I do recommend.